In Minnesota and the lower St. Croix watershed, we have a number of lakes that are referred to as natural environment lakes. Natural environment lakes refers to a classification system set up by the Minnesota Department of Natural Resources and it helps to guide resource management decisions and rules. So the natural environment classification refers to a set of rules that are meant to preserve the lakes and set minimum standards for things like lot sizes, setbacks, and to a certain degree, land use. Natural environment lakes are um, generally small, shallow lakes. So by small, we're talking about 150 acres or less. And by shallow, we're talking about 15 feet deep or less. Many natural environment lakes have minimal development and many may have development constraints due to high water tables or unsuitable soils. They host a diverse array of plants and animals. In Oxford Township, that means animals like otters, swans, and loons, and plants like wild rice, swamp loosestrife, lance leaf violet, the last two being species of special concern in Minnesota. Because they're shallow, you generally get more weeds on the surface, and that's actually an indication of a healthy lake. We want to see more weeds on the surface of the lake. The plants protect the bottom, and they hold together the entire ecosystem. They protect the sediment from wind resuspension, compete for nutrients with algae, and provide food and habitat for fish and wildlife. Healthy shallow lakes also have plants covering much of the area around the shore, such as cattails and reeds. As developmental pressures on such lakes increase, we need to be proactive about working with the county, township, and landowners to help protect them. If you have questions about your natural environment lake or the rules that apply to it, contact your local Soil and Water Conservation District county zoning department or the Minnesota Department of Natural Resources.